Hello everyone, welcome to Easy Revision. Today let us see high yield LMRPs of pathology. Selectants are responsible for rolling of neutrophils. LAD type 1 is caused by CD18 defect which is required for biosynthesis of the beta 2 chain shared by the LFA1 and MAC1 integrins. LAD type 1 leads to recurrent infections and delayed separation of the umbilical cord stump. LAD2 also known as congenital disorder of glycosylation 2C is caused by the absence of xylyl Lewis X glycoprotein. LAD type 2 leads to recurrent infections, Bombay blood group and mental retardation. LAD type 3 is caused by the mutation in FERMT3 gene. LAD type 3 leads to petechial hemorrhage, leukocytosis and recurrent infections. Opsonization is caused by C3B. FC fragment of antibody or IgG and serum proteins like fibrinogen, MBL, mannose, binding lectin and CRP. Maturation defect of B cells is known as Brunton's disease and leads to defective opsonization. MAC1 integrins are present on the surface of macrophages and helps in phagocytosis. Giant granules are seen in leukocytes of chidak higashi syndrome patients due to defective organelle fusion and degranulation. chidak igashi syndrome is caused due to list gene defect and is an autosomal recessive condition. Respiratory burst is the final step in the microbial killing occurring due to ROS and facilitated by NADPH oxidase. Defect in NADPH oxidase also known as PHOX activity and respiratory burst leads to CGD chronic granulomatous disease and leads to repeated infections by catalase positive organisms. NBT is a qualitative test whereas cyto cytochrome C reduction assay is a quantitative test for superoxide ions. Nitro blue tetrazoleum test, dihydrorhodamine test and cytochrome C reduction assay are used for detection of CGD. Nitric oxide is formed from L-arginine with the help of nitric oxide synthase. IL-1 is the most important cytokine responsible for the systemic effects of inflammation. Lipoxins are arachidonic acid metabolite with anti-inflammatory effect. Chemokines are classified according to the arrangement of conserved cystin residue in mature proteins. Activation of C3 is the most important step in the functioning of the complement system. Irrespective of the initial pathway, all complement pathways breakdown of C3 leads to formation of MAC. Functions of bradykinin include pain, contraction of smooth muscles and dilation of the venules. Hallmark of chronic inflammation is tissue destruction. Classically, activated macrophages are induced by microbial products and interferon gamma and release nitric oxide, lysosomal enzymes, IL-1 and 12. Alternatively, activated macrophages are induced by microbial products IL-4 and IL-5 and release IL-10 and TGF-beta. Langhans giant cell seen in TB has nuclei present in the periphery and in a horseshoe pattern. Tauten giant cells are seen in xanthomas, fat necrosis, xanthogranulomatous inflammation and dermatofibroma. Regeneration is proliferation of the cells and tissues to complete replace lost structures while repair occurs by regeneration and scar formation by the deposition of collagen. In amyloid, fibril proteins constitute 95% while P component constitutes 5%. SA, serum amyloid associated protein which are the precursors of AA fibril are synthesized in liver. A beta protein that is found in Alzheimer's disease is derived by proteolysis of amyloid precursor protein. Amyloid deposition is always extracellular. Amyloid appears pink or red by congruent staining under ordinary light. Amyloid shows green by refrigerance by congruent staining under polarized microscopy, most specific test. Cross beta pleated conformation causes congruent staining and by refrigerance. Most widely used histochemical technique for differentiating amyloid from other hyaline materials is congruent stain. Beta-2 microglobulin is a component of class 1 MHC, absent in class 2 MHC. 
most common cause of death in systemic or secondary amyloidosis is cardiac failure. Most common form of amyloidosis is primary amyloidosis. Complicated long-term hemodialysis, history of renal failure, carpal tunnel syndrome occurs due to A beta 2 microglobulin deposition. Normal function of transthyretin is to bind and transport thyroxin and retinol. Plasma cell disorders are associated with primary amyloidosis. Benzijones proteins are unpaired kappa or lambda light chains. Amyloidogenic potential of any particular light chain is largely determined by its specific amino acid sequence. Monoclonal gammopathy and M spike in serum electrophoresis seen in multiple myeloma. Most common association of systemic or secondary amyloidosis WW is rheumatoid arthritis followed by ankylosing, spondylitis, Crohn's disease and ulcerative colitis. Amyloidosis is reported to occur in about 3% of patients with rheumatoid arthritis. Subcutaneous heroin abusers show high risk of generalized AA amyloidosis. Most common solid tumors associated with systemic amyloidosis are RCC and Hodgkin's lymphoma. Familial Mediterranean fever is autosomal recessive autoinflammatory disorder associated with excess production of IL-1 in response to inflammatory stimuli. Gene for familial Mediterranean fever codes for pyrin protein. Familial amyloidotic polyneuropathies are autosomal dominant in nature. Endocrine amyloid deposition causes medullary carcinoma of thyroid, eyelid tumor of the pancreas, pheochromocytomas and undifferentiated carcinomas of stomach in the eyelids of Langerhans in T2 diabetes mellitus. Most common organ involved in senile amyloidosis is heart, restrictive cardiomyopathy and arrhythmias. Most common organ involved in localized amyloidosis is kidney. Most severely involved organ in localized amyloidosis is kidney. Localized amyloidosis in organ causes enlargement and a grey waxy appearance of the organ except kidney. First site of amyloid deposition in kidney is glomeruli. First site of amyloid deposition in liver is space of DC. First site of amyloid deposition in heart is focal subendocardial accumulations and within the myocardium. Laudicious spleen occurs in red pulp, sago or tapioca like spleen occurs in white pulp. AL amyloid leads to life-threatening bleeding disorder by inactivation of clotting factor 10. Chronic skin infections associated with skin popping of narcotics leads to amyloidosis. Localized amyloidosis in kidney has normal size and color initially and to be shrunken in size in later stages. Most common cause of secondary amyloidosis in India is TB. Choristoma is a lesion with normal differentiation but abnormal site. Hematoma lesion with abnormal differentiation but normal site. Desmoplasia is abundant collagenous stroma formed by stimulated parenchymal cells and is commonly seen in pancreatic adenocarcinoma and cholangiocarcinoma. Typical mitotic figures are present in dysplasia while atypical mitotic figures also known as tripolar mitosis or Merkitz benz sign are present in anaplasia. For a tumor to be clinically detectable, it should produce at least 1 or 8 cells. Metastasis is the most reliable feature of malignant tumors followed by local invasion. Anaplasia is the hallmark of malignant transformation. Lymphatic spread is the most common method of metastasis. Skip metastasis refers to bypass of regional lymph node involvement by venous lymphatic anastomosis. Sentinel lymph node is the first lymph node to receive lymph flow from a tu primary tumor and is a feature of melanoma, breast and colon cancer. Aerobic glycolysis also known as Warburg effect is the shifting of the glucose metabolism from mitochondria to glycolysis by M2 isoform of pyruvate kinase in cancer cells. 18 fluorodeoxyglucose 18FDG is used in PET scan. Cyclene D CDK4 complex during G3 phase is responsible for phosphorylation of a RB susceptibility protein which acts as a molecular on-off switch for the cell cycle. 
साइक्लिन ए सी डी के कॉम्प्लेक्स इज क्रिटिकल फॉर इनिशिएशन ऑफ डी एन ए रेप्लीकेशन जी वन एस चेक पॉइंट इज पी फिफ्टी थ्री डिपेंडेंट वेर एज जी टू एम चेक पॉइंट हैज बोथ पी फिफ्टी थ्री डिपेंडेंट एज वेल एज इंडिपेंडेंट मैकेनिजम्स जी वन एस चेक पॉइंट प्रिवेंट्स द रेप्लीकेशन ऑफ सेल्स दैट हैव डिफेक्ट्स इन डी एन ए डी कंडेंसिंग क्रोमोजोम्स आर सराउंडेड बाई न्यूक्लियर मेम्ब्रेन्स इन टीलोफिस ओवर एक्सप्रेशन ऑफ पी डी जी एफ बीटा लीड्स टू एस्ट्रोसाइटोमा एंड ऑस्टियोसारकोमा गैस्ट्रो इंटेस्टाइनल स्टोमल ट्यूमर्स एंड अदर्स ऑफ टिश्यू ट्यूमर्स अकर ड्यू टू पॉइंट म्यूटेशन ऑफ किट ए बी एल ट्रांसलोकेशन इज रेस्पॉन्सिबल फॉर क्रॉनिक माइलॉइल ल्यूकेमिया एंड एक्यूट लिम्फोब्लास्टिक ल्यूकेमिया द पॉइंट म्यूटेशन ऑफ द रास फैमिली जीन इज द सिंगल मोस्ट कॉमन एबनॉर्मैलिटी ऑफ द डोमिनेंट ऑनकोजेंस इन ह्यूमन ट्यूमर्स फर्स्ट ट्यूमर सप्रेसार जीन टू बी डिस्कर्ड वॉज आर बी जीन रेटिनोब्लास्टोमा इज एसोसिएटेड विद कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ लॉज ऑफ हेट्रो हेट्रोजाइगोसिटी एंड नेट्सन्स टू हिथ हाइपोथेसिस एम वाई सी इज द मोस्ट कॉमन न्यूक्लियर ट्रांसक्रिप्शन रेगुलेटर एफेक्टेड इन द ह्यूमन ट्यूमर्स ए बी एल एक्सप्रेस नॉन रिसेप्टर एसोसिएटेड टायरोसिन काइनेस एक्टिविटी लॉज ऑफ फंक्शन म्यूटेशन इन रेड ऑनकोजीन लीड्स टू इंटेस्टाइनल ए गैंगलियोनोसिस एंड अर्सफ्रंग डिजीज गेन ऑफ फंक्शन म्यूटेशन इन रेड ऑनकोजीन लीड्स टू मेन टू ए और टू बी सिंड्रोम्स टी जी एफ बीटा रिसेप्टर एंड ई खैदरिन आर लोकेटेड ऑन द सेल सर्फेस वाइल एन एफ वन एंड टू आर लोकेटेड ऑन द इनर एस्पेक्ट्स P53 फिफ्टी थ्री ऑल्सो नोन एज मॉलिकुलर पोलिस और गार्डियन ऑफ द जीनोम रेगुलेट्स अपोप्टोसिस एंड अरेस्ट ऑफ द सेल साइकिल इन रेस्पॉन्स टू डी एन ए डैमेज पी सिक्सटी थ्री इज क्रिटिकल फॉर द डिफ्रेंशिएशन ऑफ स्ट्रेटिफाइड स्क्वामस एपिथीलियम पी सेवेंटी थ्री एक्ट्स एज ए प्रो अपोप्टोटिक फैक्टर आफ्टर डी एन ए डैमेज बाई कीमोथेरापेटिक एजेंट्स द नॉन म्यूटेटेड पी फिफ्टी थ्री जीन ऑल्सो नोन एज वाइल्ड टाइप डिक्रीजेज रिस्क ऑफ डेवलपमेंट ऑफ कैंसर्स एम आई आर थर्टी फोर फैमिली ऑफ एम आई आर एन एज इज एक्टिवेटेड बाई पी फिफ्टी थ्री जीन ब्लूम सिंड्रोम एटैक्सिया टेलेंजेक्टेशिया एंड फैनकोनीज अनेमिया रिकॉम्बिनेशन रिपेयर डिफेक्ट्स जीरोडर्मा पिगमेंटोजम मिसमैच रिपेयर हेच एन पी सी सी न्यूक्लियोटाइड एक्सीशन रिपेयर अकोर्स ड्यू टू द डिफेक्ट्स इन डी एन ए रिपेयर पैंक्रियाटिक एंड ब्रॉन्कोजेनिक कार्सिनोमा एक्जिबिट माइग्रेटरी थ्रॉम्बोफ्लेबाइटिस ऑल्सो नोन एज ट्राउजर्स फेनोमिना ट्यूमर कैन ग्रो ओनली वन टू टू एम एम विदाउट एंजियोजेनेसिस एजरिन इज एन एग्जाम्पल ऑफ जीन इंड्यूजिंग मेटास्टासिस के आई फिफ्टी फाइव के ए आई वन प्रोस्टेट कैंसर एंड एन एम ट्वेंटी थ्री आर जीन्स इनहिबिटिंग मेटास्टासिस इनिशिएटर कार्सिनोजेनेसिस कॉज इिवर्सिबल डी एन ए डैमेज वाइल प्रमोटर कार्सिनोजेनेसिस कॉज रिवर्सिबल डी एन ए डैमेज यू वी बी रेज आर मोस्ट कार्सिनोजेनिक ड्यू टू फॉर्मेशन ऑफ पेरामिड इन डायमर्स इन डी एन ए Skin, bones, and GIT are least susceptible to radiation carcinogenesis. Basal cell carcinoma is the most common cancer occurring due to excessive UV light exposure. CLL is the only leukemia not associated with ionizing radiation exposure. NPC is the only T cell malignancy amongst the cancers caused by EBV. HPV 16 and 18 have viral genes E6 and E7 which causes RB and P53 gene inactivation respectively. SIADH is associated with the small cell carcinoma of lung and intracranial neoplasms. Unlike beta HCG, alpha HCG is not effective as tumor marker because it is similar to FSH, LH and TSH. Alpha fetoprotein is a tumor marker for liver cell cancer, non-seminomatous germ cell tumors of testis. CEA is a tumor marker for colon, pancreas, lung, stomach and heart carcinomas. P53 and RAS mutations in stool and serum are effective tumor markers for pancreatic carcinomas. Lysozyme and HAM56 are responsible for fibrohistocytic tumors while factor 8 and CD34 are essential for endothelial tumors. In malignant melanoma, HMB45 is more specific while S100 is more sensitive. NSE is more specific whereas chromogranin and synaptophysin are more sensitive tumor markers for NET tumor formation. Tumor lysis syndrome consists of hyperkalemia, hyperuricemia, hyperphosphatemia, lactic acidosis and hypokalemia.
Mockenberg arteriosclerosis also known as medial calcific sclerosis involves the tunica media of arteries especially radial and ulnar arteries and seen in greater than 50 years old Mockenberg arteriosclerosis is associated with dystrophic calcification Hyperplastic arteriosclerosis is marked by concentric laminated onion skin thickening of the arteriolar walls Atherosclerosis is most common cause of significant morbidity caused by vascular disease Foam cells are lipid laden SM cells, smooth muscle cells, tissue macrophages or blood monocytes. Lerich syndrome is iotoiliac occlusive disease characterized by buttock claudication, sexual impotence and decreased femoral pulses. Post MI rupture and leakage at the site of vascular anastomosis are the two most common causes of pseudoaneurysm. The most important complication of atherosclerosis is IHD and MI. HDN is the most common cause of ascending aortic aneurysm. Atherosclerotic aneurysms most frequently occur in the descending part, especially in abdominal aorta. Aneurysms due to CMN, cystic medial necrosis, are the most common aneurysms of the aortic root. Tree bark appearance is seen in cephalitic aneurysm. Dissecting aneurysm is usually seen as longitudinal intraluminal tear in the ascending iota due to hypertension and CMN. Medial degeneration is a characteristic pre-existing lesion in aortic dissection patients. Hereditary hemorrhagic telangiectasia, also known as Oslo-Weber-Rendu syndrome, follows autosomal dominant pattern and complications include epistaxis and GI bleed. Hemangioma is the most common tumor of infancy and causes port wine stain birthmarks. Cystic hygroma is a cavernous hem lymphangioma that most common seen in the neck axilla associated with Turner syndrome. Epidemic Kaposi sarcoma occurs as a component of AIDS. Pan is necrotizing immune complex inflammation of small and medium sized arteries. Churkstruck syndrome also known as allergic granulomatous angiitis predominantly involves pulmonary vasculature and mimics asthma. HSP is characterized by antecedent URTI followed by hemorrhagic urticaria, fever, arthralgia as well as GIT and renal involvement. Wegner granulomatosis is associated with C. anca also known as PR3 anca and predominantly manifests with respiratory tract signs and symptoms. P. anca also known as MPO anca is associated with the conditions like microscopic polyangitis, Churkstruck syndrome, GPS, PSC, ulcerative colitis, etc. Temporal arteritis is the most common form of vasculitis and usually involves elderly patients. Thromboangitis obliterans, also known as Burgess disease, involves small to medium sized arteries of the ex extremities and is clearly exacerbated by heavy cigarette smoking. Lymphomatoid granulomatosis is associated with the EBV infection and immunosuppression. Major source of erythropoietin is interstitial cells in peritubular capillaries and tubular epithelial cells. Oligohydramnias is marked complication of bilateral renal agenesis and is associated with single umbilical artery. Massive proteinuria greater than or equal to 4 gram protein per day and hypoalbuminemia less than 3 gram per 100 ml are prominent features of nephritic syndrome. Heyman antigen or megalin is located on visceral epithelial cells. Anionic antigen form subendothelial deposits, cationic antigen form subepithelial deposits and neutral antigen forms mesangial deposits. PSGN is caused by cytoplasmic antigen endostreptosin and a cationic proteinase antigen NSAP nephritis strain associated protein. Characteristic electron dense humps and lumpy bumpy immunofluorescence along with hypercellular swollen bloodless glomeruli are seen in PSGN. Minimal change disease also known as lipoid nephrosis is characterized by no visible basement membrane changes fused epithelial food processes and a limit accumulation in renal tubular cells. Membranous glomerulonephritis is characterized by intramembranous and subepithelial immune complex deposits leading to thickened basement membrane, granular immunofluorescence and spike and dome appearance. Membranous glomerulonephritis is associated with hepatitis B, syphilis or malaria infection, drugs and malignancy. 
FSGS is characterized by sclerosis within capillary tufts of deep juxtamedullary glomeruli. NOS variant is the most common variant of FSGS. Glomerular tip variant has the best prognosis while collapsing variant has the worst prognosis in FSGS. Alpha actin in mutation leading to AD autosomal dominant FSGS while podosin mutation leads to autosomal recessive FSGS. Type 4 diffuse a proliferative form is the most severe form of lupus nephritis and exhibits a combination of both nephritic and nephritic features. Type 4 lupus nephritis is marked by wire loop abnormality and subendothelial immune complex deposition. Smoky brown urine and a red cell cache are seen in nephritic syndrome. GPS also known as anti-glomerular basement disease leads to linear immunofluorescence and manifest as nephritic syndrome and a pneumonitis with hemoptysis. Uremia is the cause of death in good pasture syndrome. Focal glomerulonephritis can be differentiated from FSGS by inflammatory and proliferative changes rather than sclerotic as seen in FSGS. Renal amyloidosis is marked by birefragrance under polarized light and crisscross fibrillary pattern on electron microscopy. Presence of glycogen accumulation in proximal tubular cells also known as Armani Epstein cells is a characteristic feature of diabetic nephropathy. Capillary basement membrane thickening is the earliest morphological abnormality which is seen in virtually all diabetics irrespective of proteinuria and is best detected with electron microscopy. Microalbuminuria, urine excretion of 30 to 300 mg of albumin per 24 hours is an important clinical predictor of development of uh, diabetic nephropathy. Hyalinizing arteriolar sclerosis in diabetic nephropathy characteristically affects both efferent and efferent arterioles. Alport syndrome is caused by COL4A5 gene mutation. Alport syndrome leads to irregular glomerular basement membrane thickening with splitting of the lamina densa and features of nephritic syndrome. Berger disease also known as IgA nephropathy manifest as benign recurrent hematuria in children usually following an infection lasting 1 to 2 days. Berger disease is the most common glomerulonephritis in adults. Berger disease is the most common cause of recurrent hematuria. Berger disease can cause as a component of HSP and shows mesangial expansion on light microscopy with granular mesangial IgA and lambda light chains deposition on immunofluorescence. Prognosis in RPGN is related to the number of crescents as it correlates with oliguria. Serum of a type 2 MPGN patients contains C3 nephrotic nephritic factor C3NEF which causes persistent degradation of C3 and leads to hypocomplementemia. Syphilis, cystosomiasis and HBV children infection are associated with MGN. HBV adults and toxoplasmosis are associated with MPGN. MPGN is marked by reduplication of glomerular basement membrane into two layers leads to characteristic tram track appearance best seen with the silver stains. Crescents in RPGN are composed of parietal cells, leukocytes and fibrin. MCD is the most common primary cause of nephrotic syndrome in children. FSGS is the most common primary cause of nephrotic syndrome in adults. DM is the most common systemic as well as overall cause of nephrotic syndrome. Adult PKD follows autosomal dominant pattern and is also associated with polycystine protein PKD1, PKD2, PKD3 gene mutations. Childhood PKD follows autosomal recessive pattern and is associated with PKHD1, fibrocystine protein gene mutations. Childhood PKD presents with renal insufficiency in infancy and is associated with multiple hepatic cyst and congenital hepatic fibrosis. Dehydration is the most common cause of primary renal vein thrombosis in children. Ascending infection is the most common route of pyelonephritis caused by all bacteria except TV, hematogenous spread. In chronic glomerulonephritis, kidneys are diffusely and symmetrically scarred, while chronic pyelonephritis shows irregular and asymmetric scarring. Most common site of origin of urinary calculi is the kidney and 20 to 30 years of male are most common to be affected. 
Calcium oxalate is the most common urinary calculi and idiopathic hypercalciuria is its most common cause. Magnesium ammonium phosphate also known as true white also known as triple stones are coffin lid shaped. Tam horsefall protein is a protein secreted by epithelial cells of loop of Henle. Broad granular casts arise in conditions with decreased renal mass like chronic renal failure. Pigmented muddy brown granular cast occurs in ischemia and nephrotoxic injury like tubular necrosis. Triad of cerebellar hemangioblastoma, bilateral RCC and retinal angiomatosis is seen in VHL syndrome. Upper pole of kidneys is most common to be affected in RCC. Chromophobe variety of RCC exhibit extreme hypodiploidy. Collecting duct carcinoma also known as Bellini duct carcinoma is the most common variant of RCC and the carcinoma cells have prominent stoma. Triad of intermittent hematuria, palpable mass and flank pain is seen in renal cell carcinoma.